What's up guys? Well, I have a lot of updates and I think I got two clutches of eggs here. Not positive, but I might, I really might have two clutches here shortly. Um, don't know what's going on with that female, but I know I have one for sure, so we're just going to collect some eggs really quickly. And here we go. Mama, move your butt, girl. There's some nice fertile leopard gecko eggs right there. Nice two eggs from my female from Spain. She has dirt everywhere. This whole tank needs to be cleaned out now. So here's one. Nice and hard and firm. So second one, same deal. So good, they look great. Some nice two eggs. Um, can't wait for these babies to hatch. Got six eggs so far from this female, so um, I am super excited. All right, so we're going to go in the incubator. I've had four hatchlings so far. I'm going to show you all four. All right, so we're just going to take out this right here. but that's fine I mean look how big this baby's gonna be <sighs> guys I mean that egg's huge I mean there's my finger next to this egg it is huge I can't wait One thing that I'm going to be enjoying is these babies hatching out. You can just tell how big that egg is. If I get dual babies out of that, I will be insanely happy. I mean, that's huge. I mean, look at the size difference. Just laid, laid, that. But these eggs were huge. I mean, this one's almost ready to hatch. I mean, that's huge. Here, I'm pulling this egg out. We'll take a look at it, guys. Look how big that egg is. That's huge. Oh my gosh, that's so big. You can see that vein run right up it. This is probably one of the biggest leopard gecko eggs that... I mean, look at this. This egg is huge. It has to be like a record or something. I don't know. I've never seen an egg that big of a leopard gecko egg. I think that, that has to be the biggest leopard gecko egg I've ever seen in my life. That egg's huge. It's like a small chicken egg. It's bigger than a butt and quail egg. This thing's huge. I've never seen an egg that big. It's like a it's like a corn snake egg, but yeah, just like a corn snake egg. It is huge. My gosh, that's going to be one big baby. Oh my gosh. Hold up. The egg's moving a little bit too much. Indent it a little bit more. That way the egg doesn't move. The biggest egg I will ever see in my life from a leopard gecko. Probably right there. Oh my gosh, that's huge. That baby's probably going to be a keeper. This pro baby's probably going to get so big. I mean, I, I swear that's the biggest egg I've ever seen in my life. Yeah, I'm going to put this right there. Oops. Well, now you're going to see the other clutch of eggs from this girl. and see the female egg, which is really big too. Gosh, both these eggs are huge. Here, put them in 
this down for a second. It's about 90 degrees in there. Again, a huge egg. I mean, look at that. Look at that. The other one's bigger because it's almost ready to hatch. This one isn't quite ready yet. And I know that because it's almost ready to hatch. What? Because it's almost. At the end of this month, it should be about 45 days. So, it's huge. I mean, just insane. Alright, so let's show you the babies. I'm going to put her back. Good job, Mama. Hopefully we get another clutch from Stella. That would be stellar. Um, get it? Stellar? Stella. Never mind, I'll shut up now. Um, anyway, here are the little babies. This little guy looks like a Sunglo Bella Bino. This one actually turned out really, really bright. That's all orange. It's like solid orange. <laughs> He's not an eclipse, sadly. But he is gorgeous. Definitely carries that eclipse gene in them, you can kind of tell. These are the first babies from Stella Cross to the Sun Glow radar. So, this is definitely a Hypo Bella Albino. Crazy looking, though. I mean, insane. I would say this one almost looks like a super Hypo, but I know Stella has some crazy tangerine influence on her end. Here's the other baby just a regular Bella Albino. Is ready to eat now. That see that green poop? That's how you tell they're ready to eat. It's a little baby bell. No arrowhead in these bells. Um, I don't think I have any arrowheads coming out this season. Here is my favorite baby, the Snow Glow. One hundred percent pet radar. Eating well. I'll actually throw some more food in there for this little guy. Um, which was your water dish? Is it, no, that's food. So there. He's eating great. You can see the little poops. Doing great. Loving these little guys. And here's a little baby bell sun glow. This one's eating great too. Doing really good. All these babies are. They turn out great. I know this because I have a uh, baby bell sun glow that hatched out similar, but this one's actually even brighter, and you can even see keratin starting to form. Really awesome babies. Really insane. I'm really looking forward to these guys. Um, they should look mostly like this gecko right there, except for that one bell. So that's it guys, comment, rate, and subscribe, hope you enjoyed the video.